All right, here we are at 516 Double Springs with Avi Elfersi. You guys are gonna be so impressed with the uh, the work that's been done over these last couple weeks. Hey guys, come on in, let's check it out. So we've got, um, the guys have been busy here this week. We got electrical rough fit, or uh, finish trimmed out. We got HVAC trim out started. We got the plumbing trimmed out. You saw the flooring guys here, they started their patch. So we've got a little bit of drying still to do. They'll probably be back later today to start laying the laminate flooring. We've got that staged over here, so let's walk through and see it. Um, so we have two, we probably got 10 cans in this room and then a ceiling fan. So lots of natural light coming through the window. And then at night we've got the overhead light, the recessed lights and all the closets um, throughout the living space, I think really modernizes the space. And then with ceilings that are only eight feet tall, not having a lot of light fixtures come down helps to elevate the ceiling height a little bit more. So coming through, you can now see how this kitchen, once we have all this flooring in, the kitchen and the living room will flow together really nicely. Look at that kitchen space. Yeah, but now you've got a nice kitchen space. You've got, we can come through here and you can see. This was a bedroom before, right? Yeah, this was a bedroom. So now you got plenty of kitchen space. It spans over here into a pantry. Oh, careful. And then we've got the, the full laundry room in here. The plumbing guys have already roughed that or uh, finished that out. So it's a great um, size laundry room. Yeah, whether it's additional storage space, a mud room, laundry room, however you're going to use it, uh, we found lots of little pockets of space in this house. So again, this kitchen very functional. Three feet in between the island and the, and the uh, countertops, um, all the way around. So plenty of space to work. Plenty mm -hmm. of space for multiple people to be in here. You got the stove going there with the overhead. Um, uh, down at the, the draft hood, We've got a microwave here, dishwasher, uh, fridge obviously goes here, so very functional space. Um, set up for a table if somebody wants there. Uh, you can easily put a dining table out here if you actually needed a dining room, but you know, the four bedroom house like this, you've got lots of entertaining space. Yeah. So coming through here, you can see all the lights again, recessed lights throughout the hallway, ceiling fans in all the bedrooms. Um, Plumbing trim out was in, we've already got the faucets in. Um, you can see we've got tubs ready to go, toilets in. This house is almost ready to live in. Um, we've got our next step will be laminate flooring going in in all the common areas in the next day or two. And then beyond that, we'll do a final paint touch up coming through all the little nicks and scratches that we've gotten throughout. We'll get touched up. Outside, we're going to be doing, once we get a couple warm days of, of dry weather, we'll be coming through and painting all the white trim, soffits and fascia outside, and then we'll do an accent color on the brick out front. So you can see all the closets have built-ins. Um, you know, moving into this house, somebody's going to really enjoy it. Yes. So this is that hall bathroom. Lots of space in here. You got the full shower, obviously a toilet, van, but big vanity. Um, our guys do a great job. We got the soft close hinges. Um, a little bit of, still a little bit of cleanup to do, but nice pulls on everything. Everything's with the oil rub bronze. Looks nice, really, really attractive out here in the country. I think somebody's gonna love it out here. And then let's take a look, we've got in the backyard, you can see we've got the lights. I think we put them in upside down, so we'll be coming back and flipping them around to go up. But we've got lights outside, we've got spotlights outside. Um, all the doorways have lights. We've got down lights on the uh, front porch. And then we've got a post light on the corner. So if you're coming home here at night, even though you're out in the country, the house will be lit up nicely. Um, master bedrooms, you have recessed lights in the master bedroom. Nice big ceiling fan in here. And then we got this trimmed out. So and I keep going back to, for, for what this house had for a master bathroom. Oh my goodness. Originally till today, I mean, the whole bathroom was as big as this small area was. Um, it, was a, it was a sink like you'd find in a 7-Eleven bathroom. Uh, so now it's very easy for two people to, to get ready in the morning. Um, again, the small thing like, like the raised countertops, you know. Yeah. Like, it's really? just great. It's just ready to go. Mm -hmm. I love, from a cleaning perspective, having the solid granite's great. The full, the full width granite versus just the granite overlay, and then the undermount rectangular sink. So it's a modern approach 
Um, so whomever lives here is going to be living in a modern, fully renovated, fully updated house. Uh, again, we got the recessed lights in here. So whether this is going to be a rental house, or this is going to be your personal home, this is your forever home, uh, you know, we took all the steps to make it so whomever lives here is going to enjoy it. Yeah. So it's going to be great. Hit the market in just probably two weeks or so. So check back with Will and his team and we'll, uh, I don't imagine this will be on the market for very long though. <laughs> Thanks so much, Avi. Take care guys.